seven people hope you all well oh my day it's fully gave away my address i'm now leaving to go to the airport guys you know how it is man especially with the asian household if you're going to the airport the whole family's coming to you. send off yes people so we are now on the plane uh, ready to ready to fly out man but yeah i am going to keep you guys posted you guys did say you want to see the whole journey and see what happens when we get there um, but yeah it's crazy like doing this on the plane is actually quite mad but still it's calm man you gotta do what you gotta do right sorry thank you thank you sorry thank you So right now, I am without my vinyl wrap. Uh, so both luggages are here, but then on the screen it is saying no more bags. So I'm thinking now, what's going on? The main man is here himself. Let's go, let's go, finally. Come on. We've got a big, 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 big job, big project ahead, but we're going to get it, man. Guys, it's nice. It's hot here. Let me pull out again. Journey starts now, man. Firm me out here, Saudi Arabia, Riyadh. We out here, man. Ashla just reached uh, Bilal's apartment now. Ashla is absolutely beautiful on the 12th floor. Stunning place. Wow. It is mega early. Um, it's about 6, 6 15, 6 20 now. And um, we're doing this, we're getting into the lift. And here it is it is the Ford Bronco. In regards to wrapping, um, obviously it's got similar shapes to the, the G Wagon, you know, with the, the wide arches there. Um, also the similar bumper shape. It's going to be very interesting actually. Very, very interesting. Um, but yeah, let's go. It has been absolutely so overwhelming today. Just a lot, lot going on in the car, getting it done. Just been at it non-stop to be honest. Also has have had some time to speak to um, a few potential uh, clients, which has been really, really good. I mean, networking out here is no joke. These guys are serious. I, this place is crazy. There you go. Red carpet, the feel. This here, uh, there's so much going on here, man. It's mad. It's actually crazy. Live music out in Saudi, man. Today we started at 4.15, yeah, about 4 o'clock, 4.15. This is a mess right now, I'm gonna tidy it up, give you a little bit of a look. Badges are now in reflective. Mm. Today is obviously Friday Jumma, uh, so we'll be finishing up a little bit early. Um, but yeah, I mean, we are on schedule at the moment. <laughs>
nice one. All the trimmings, absolutely perfect finish. Wrapping in Saudi is mad. The amount of mosquitoes that have been biting me is crazy. Ooh, okay, so we have a situation. When you're wrapping a vehicle, it is pretty much straightforward, um, very easy. But of course, if you know what you're doing, but you do come across, can come across a few hurdles. The door, the driver's side, uh, we've taken off the door handle, extremely simple to take off. However, where you enter with the key, the lock mechanism does not come out. We would have to remove the door card. However, I have left my pick tool and a few other tools back in London. Okay, these things happen. Um, and when they do, you just got to work around it, man. It is what it is. I'm in Saudi, can't exactly fly back, can't go anywhere to go collect what I need as well. So we're going to work around it. Let's do this, man. Let's do this. And there you go. Door handle is now out. As you can see, the door does not close. If you want the door to close again, what you have to do is get the wrench, plug it back in, and just tighten it. Um, tighten it again until you hear the click. There you go. That allows you to close the door. Let's go. Let's get this all prepped and uh, ready to wrap. Today we are at 4x4 Centre. Bilal has brought us here because he wants to pick up some alloys. Guys, there were so many animals in mind, it's crazy. It's uh, an update on the Bronco. The driver's side, we are now going to start assembling it back together and then we're gonna go ahead and start attacking the passenger side. Uh, it's already been disassembled already. Now it's just surface cleaner and wrap. What time is it? It is 1 a.m. We are. You know what we're gonna do? We're gonna keep going because we're wide awake and active. <laughs> So an update on the Bronco, um, we have been working throughout the whole night just to keep up with um, our plan of action. It is extremely tough, um, but we are getting there. Uh, we're just about to wrap the rear quarter. Um, after we've done that, we are gonna go get some shut eye because I am absolutely shattered. Yeah, we have to, have to, have to get the car wrapped tonight because the car needs to get sort of coated. Um, so yeah, it's, it's, it's going to be a long day, a long day. I'm absolutely knackered, um, but the, the car is fully wrapped. It is completed with ceramic as well. Thank you, Polish Mobile, for supplying us with the ceramic. I job on this though. It looks absolutely amazing. Staring at it right now from this view is just, it's wow. It looks, it looks mad. It looks mad. I love it. I love these cars anyway, in general, but I think it just looks absolutely amazing. Started the calipers today, so out of the four, we have now done three front, right, that's left now. These calipers are no joke, mate. <laughs> they are extremely difficult, but we are getting there. And then the car's complete.
Yeah man, this is not looking good. So the door handle is now, well it's deadlocked, the back boot. Ford is closed, so we've come to a private dealership. Inshallah, hopefully it gets fixed man. So we will crack on. Open. How are you? Right, so it wasn't supposed to be today we're driving the vehicle, it was supposed to be tomorrow. But well, due to unforeseen circumstances, we had to take the car out to sort out um, the door handle, which is alhamdulillah all sorted. The law was stressing, I was so stressing, lovely, but it's fixed, it's done. The guys um, out here can do everything. Everything, honestly. bro. Everything. He, just, he just gave me a price and he said, I'll get it done, don't done. worry. Done. Lovely. Straight away onto it. No waiting, no games, no nothing. Boom. That is a wrap. We are fully complete now. Uh, vehicles all done. It's just sitting, um, getting some nice natural sunlight. And now I am going to enjoy the rest of the time that I have left. Probably the most sophisticated bloody shopping center I've seen in my life, bruv. It is so quiet in here. But they've got all the biggest, biggest, biggest brands that you can think of. They've got it all. But it's just so flipping quiet. So I've been here for just over a week now. And not once have I touched McDonald's. Because the food here is amazing. So there's no need. But now I'm having McDonald's. So, we are about to go right there, right to the top. Guys, it is my last day. The car is obviously completed. It was completed yesterday. We are out and about. Bilal is going to take me to a few more places before we head out to Umrah tomorrow, inshallah. Good old days, yeah? Yeah, bro. It's been a while. It's been a while, it's been a while, but we're gonna about to hit this. Uh, let's get ready to rumble! Come on, bro. Yeah, hit it, hit it. Boom. Bam. Bop. Bada bop, boom. Yeah. yeah, that's it, that's it. Come on. That's it. Come on. Chase, come on. <laughs> Yeah, there is a little bit. Yeah. 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 Ye
Alhamdulillah, Umrah is near um, enough completed now. Mashallah, it was amazing. Yeah, I don't mind, bro. First Tarawi tonight. Yeah, boy. We got lucky. Yeah, Alhamdulillah. Ramadan in the Mecca. Forward to it, bro. It should be really nice. Now it is time for me to come home. Finally making ways back to London, Heathrow. Um, no one sitting next to me.